Alright, what is going on guys? Today we are watching Ranking of Kings episode 19. Last episode ended on a huge cliffhanger and I'm so excited to see what's to come now, what's going to happen with Kage. Um, and yeah, as always guys, like the video if you like the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. And let's go into this episode right now. Oh damn, it for real swallowed him up. Do you know what you just did, Kage? Oh no. Bro, what? The last bastion. Ooh. Oh, is this one of the gods? Oh god. Damn. The error of the gods is nigh. Oh, it's... Oh, shit, dude. Oh, cut off her hands, peeled off her face. These pieces of shits, bro. So you killed them all, right, bossa? Rightfully so. Oh, shit. Did you go Titan mode on them? Or did you just squish them? Shit, boss, eh? Oh, my God. He killed everyone. What the hell are they? Body parts? Ooh. Was this so he took like skin off of other people? Kinda wanna hear more about this story though. Damn, dude. The plot is thick right now, dude. You're stepping on Kage? How fucking dare you, Okan? Everybody is defeated right now. Who did he hit? Who did he hit? Oh, <gasps> he actually stabbed Bodgy. It's an illusion. It's something. What is this? And we know Oaken doesn't hit vital spots, so... Is he healing him? Oh shit, okay. Is he getting, like, the view of all of her memories or something? What is going on? Despot is learning about her entire life, it looks like. Whoa, what's going on? Where the fuck are we? Oh, shit, his mom's here. Are we dead? Oh, damn. <laughs> Despot. Maybe this river kind of shows, like, between life and death, then. Or maybe they're here to stop Kage from crossing the river. Yeah, you need to stop him. Oh, shit! Fucking invisible barrier, that's not fair. Then how do we stop him? The handsome really don't die. <laughs> oh, I love this guy. So he's not really crossing over. He's just inside of Madanjo's mind, or... He is crossing over. I don't know. Madanjo stopping him from crossing over. <laughs> Iyayo! <laughs> This isn't really his mum, though. Like, it's just like a... an illusion of his mum. His mum would not want him to die. Boji is his reason for existence, dude. Yeah, this is not his fucking mum. His mum would never say that. Oh. oh, my heart. My heart. I can't take it. Oh, <laughs> I can't take this, man. It's like 10 minutes into the episode. Well, maybe that is his mom. Maybe she's just excited to see him finally, but if he's got stuff left on Don, he has to stay. 
He was just a little baby when you left him. Look at him. He's so grown up. Ugh! God damn, this is emotional. I am in love with these black blobs, man. Such good characters. <laughs> oh, that's just how you are, Kage. What a pure soul. Do you even know where to go, Kage? Oh, I'm starting to like Melanjo. Oh shit, she grew a hand. And her face, maybe? Is this how she becomes whole again? I remember who uh, who this little voice actor, who else they've done, but I've heard their voice before and it makes me cry every time they speak. Pretty soon, someone will come to save you. I really want it to be Bodgy that saves Dida. Oh shit, the woman you killed. And your mum. Mate, if Hilling was here, she would find some power, bro. Trust. Are you going to eat the snake? Okay, no. Oh, damn, this animation. <gasps> no, don't kill the snake, please. Oh, my God. Is this a tail? Or is it the, the head that's missing? Jesus, they're going off with this art. Oh, my God. <gasps> no, please, don't kill the snake. Oh, shit, baby. Slices. Fucking in half, dude. Oh my god. That's insane. Oh yes, dude. Bro, all the strong fighters. Let's get it. Wasn't she just healing him? Or was she just going inside of... Bringing him inside of his memory or what? Who? Who? Who else can heal? Bro, having all these strong fighters in the same place? Pretty lit. <laughs> Any, but anything is a bad match against someone who's immortal. Dumbass. It's the fact that his armor heals as well. That's the annoying thing. And the sword too. The sword heals. So annoying. I just had a thought, what is this black fluid? Oh my god, that's so good, bro. Like, what if this black fluid is like, Kage? Not, not Kage, but like, Kage's people. Or is it just some random black fluid? <gasps> Bebin! But it's gonna grow back. Oh no, it's just gonna reattach. It's like, it's almost like hands, like it looks like venom. It's like, almost looks like a hand though. It's like, what if this is like Kage's kind? Oh, fuck yeah, dude. It's like we got the fighter, the assassin, swordsman, spearman, or lancer. Bruh. Oh, <laughs> this fight animation, it's, it's like simple in a sense, but it's like so well done. Oh my god, Dorashi. I wouldn't want to see Oken's face right now. The big four, yeah. I feel bad for him inside that suit, though. Like, look at him. He's not, not in his head. And this is young him, without his moustache. No, this is not the time to be getting power-ups. He's on the enemy side. God, I hope they can save him soon. Bro, he's actually such a beast. 
<gasps> oh god. What did he just do? Like he fired something at him or? Yeah, he's just firing something at them. He's like aiming like directly for the heart, it looks like. Bro, such a badass group of people. Oh my god. The last bastion. Yes, sir. Oh, has to end there, doesn't it? Oh my god. All right, so that was Ranking of Kings episode 19. Oh, that was a good episode. Um, didn't get a lot of explanation, actually, as to Kage's kind of crazy big form. I thought they were going to go more into that, but it turns out that he just it was just him going big in like a, you know, an emotional daze. Um, like he usually does with like he carries loads of shit inside of him. So it makes sense that he's just able to grow bigger. Um, I thought it was some kind of like monster point or something. Um, but yeah, then he kind of just returned back to normal after that. But then Oaken was, you know, managed to break out. Um, and then the whole emotional sequence inside of Menandra's head or mind uh, with Kage and his mom and Boji and Despa and oh, tears, just tears. Anything to do with Kage, he's such a bro, such a loyal like companion. Oh, perfect characters, man. I fucking love this show. Um, and then just the whole thing with like the, the big four, bro. Oh, it's be beautiful fight animation. Um, very subtle, but very... Oh, it's so good. This show is just a masterpiece. Uh, yeah, really looking forward to seeing this now. Hopefully everybody recovers okay. Despa, Boji, Kage are still down and out. Um, I don't know who's going to be able to fix this. They said something about another healer, whoever that healer may be. I don't know. Can't think of anybody off the top of my head. Um, unless they're speaking about Maranjo, maybe. I don't know. But uh, they all seem to be kind of aware of who the healer might be. And I remember saying, Domas saying he didn't know who Maranjo was. So there must be someone else I'm missing here. Or someone we just haven't been introduced to yet. Uh, but yeah, overall a freaking great episode. And I'm excited for the next episode now. And anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I certainly did. And I hope you guys enjoyed my reaction. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out.